For exercise, you're going to collect two sides of right triangle and we're going to give the hypotenuse. But we're going to collect all the exceptions I could think of. So I go around forever in my get x, y, and it takes in a string for a prompt. I'm going to give that prompt. If somebody does a keyboard interrupt or an EOF error, I return none. If they give me nothing or the lowercase version of what they gave me is a Q, I return none. Here I am trying to make a float out of each of the values that came in and put them in X and Y. From that line can come a type error, a name error, a value error, or a syntax error. And then I will print two numbers are required, otherwise I return the X and Y. In my main, I'm calling get XY. So now my XY has a tuple in it or a none. If it has the none, then I'm in here and I'm going to the next line and I'm finished. I'm out of my loop and finished. Otherwise, I am putting the X and the Y as two separate arguments into hypot. Here's hypot with X and Y and math has a hypot. We print the answer, we're done. I'll see you for the next lab.